Number 5. Art Pavilion and the Mestrovic Gallery The original iron structure of the Zagreb Art Pavilion, designed for the International Exposition in Budapest in 1896, was moved and restored on its present location. Number 4. The Museum of Mimara In order to house a collection presented by a private collector, Antitopic Mimara in 1972, the Museum of Mimara was established. This enormous collection, which includes a wide range of things from various regions and eras, is housed in a neo reinized edifice constructed particularly for it in 1895. Number 3. Museum of Contemporary Art The Museum of Contemporary Art, one of the Zagreb's newest museums and the biggest and most contemporary in Croatia, is a must-visit for anyone with even the slightest interest in art. It is frequently referred to as MSU and was opened in 2009 as a result of its collections outgrowing its initial galleries, which were built in the 1950s. Number 2. Lord Strack Tower The Lord Strack Tower, which was constructed in the 13th century to guard the southern gate of the Gradic Town Hall, is one of the Zagreb's most recognizable structures. According to legend, the substantial square Romanesque tower once housed a bell that rang out each evening before the gates closed to summon people who lived outside the walls to return. Number 1. Gornji Grad With its cobblestone streets and red-tiled roofs, Gornji Grad perfectly sets the atmosphere in Zagreb. Though the cheerful chants of neighborhood youngsters playing football in the street jolt you back to the present, meandering the little stone-walled passages is a true time-travel experience.